Let's talk about turbo chain redundancy. A turbo ring is great, but it does limit you in that you have to have a ring topology in order to deploy it. With turbo chain, you have more flexibility in the topology itself. You no longer have to have a ring connected to a ring. You can make a variety of different shapes in your topology and be flexible. So we'd like to show you how it works today. Let me explain a little bit about the topology of turbo chain technology. Over here, you can see our turbo chain, these three switches. The first switch here is called a head. The head switch is the switch that has the primary connection back to the other network. You can see it here through the blue cable connected to this other network, which happens to be turbo ring. The next switch down the chain is called the member switch. The member switch is any switch between the head and the tail. Which of course, this last switch in the chain is called the tail. Now, the tail switch has, also has a connection to the other network, but this connection is blocked until there is a network redundancy event. Then it opens up and provides an alternate path for the communication. So to show how Turbo Chain performs just as well as Turbo Ring, what we're going to do is show the same video stream over the network here. We have a video encoder putting network video over the ring uh, and then over to the chain, across all the chain switches, and then back to the laptop. So now I'll show you a live feed here. Here's some digitized video. What we're going to do is interrupt this stream right here. I will disconnect this port. You can see I've disconnected it. You didn't see any interruption in network service. I'm going to reconnect. And again, no change in the video feed itself. So, now you can see that we've interrupted the video stream. We watched the network redundancy recover, reroute the network traffic across the alternate path through the turbo ring, and it all worked out in less than 20 milliseconds, up to 250 switches. Thanks for watching.